Ignore this weird face cam angle here, yee. But you know how to find Java Edition on your computer in the files, but you may not know how to find Windows 10 Edition of Minecraft. So today, I'm gonna to be showing you how you can do that. If you learned something new, make sure you smash the like button really good and subscribe if you are new so you don't miss out on the best pocket edition, bedrock edition shaders. Anyway, let's get into showing you where to find the file. So you probably know by now that Minecraft Java Edition is in app data, then you have to go to this roaming and then dot Minecraft, and this is all Java Edition stuff here. So this has nothing to do with Windows 10 Edition here, so just ignore all of this because you don't need to go here. But to find Bedrock Edition, you need to go back into Users. I'm going to backtrack a bit, and as you can see, I've gone back to my Windows page here. So as you can see, we have the Users options at the bottom here. So you need to go into these Users options, and then you need to click on User. Once you are in here, you do need to actually get onto app data. So if it is hidden, you have to go into view, then you have to go into hidden icons. As you can see here, it is already on. So if I turn it off, as you can see, app data goes away, but you need to turn it on. So you need to show the hidden folders. Oh, so you need to go into app data, but you don't need to go into roaming. So roaming is where you go to find Java edition. You want to go into local. As you can see, we are clicking into local, but you need to find an additional folder in here. So as you can see, there is a few folders here, but the one you want is the one what is called packages. As you can see right here, we have this packages folder. So you want to click into this packages folder. And as you can see here, we just got a bunch of nonsense. My goodness. So it's just easy to go into the search bar and just search into Minecraft. As you can see, it's got to come up with this folder called Microsoft.Minecraft and you want to click into here. So when you click into it, as you can see, when you click into here, you want to go into local state. So this folder right here, inside this folder, you want to go into games. And then as you can see, we have a com.mojang folder right here and you want to go into it. And as you can see, we have our behavior packs in here which is empty because I don't have any. And we also have our resource packs in here. So as you can see, I've got a few resource packs in here. So they're all my resource packs that I have installed into the game. So this is how you get into the Windows 10 folders, files, I guess you want to say. And you can go into your worlds, as you can see, if you want to back up your worlds or do something with your worlds. The world folder is in there too, which is really useful. But that is it for today's tutorial. If you did enjoy or learn something new, make sure you drop a like. It means the world to me. But that is it. Sorry for this weird face cam setup. I know, it's just weird angles. <laughs> but that is it. I'll see you in the next one. And peace.